How's it going everyone? My name is Darzeth and welcome back to another episode of Bee Swarm Simulator. And today I got a topic that we need to talk about. And some of you might agree, some of you might disagree, but we're going to be talking about it either way. So leave your comments below about what you think about what I'm about to talk about. And before we get into all the crazy stuff that I'm going to be saying, guys, I'm not going to be able to finish this. No, I am so far behind. I am literally on the festive finale, and we already know there's 10 more quests after this, and I'm not going to be able to complete it. I know, sad day. I've been super busy with a lot of stuff. You guys did not know I just moved, but we'll be talking about that more in a little bit. Or maybe not today at all. Whatever. So anyhow, we're going up to the boost market, which is going to be the topic of today's video on why on it should reset it. So, just to show you guys exactly what I'm talking about, a lot of you may not be at this point, and some of you may or may not know what I'm talking about. So, anyhow, this is what we're dealing with right now. 10 trillion for Cloverfield, Pineapple Patch, 9 tr trillion, and so forth along the line. But as you see, it does get some boost every now and then, it goes up. But basically, they don't change very much from when you get more boost to less boost. So, I'll prove this right now by going down here. This has the same amount as if this would here. So my topic of today is he should definitely reset this because no one has that much honey when you first enter this market area. And I'm sure there's going to be a lot of people that are super duper excited about checking it out going, oh my gosh, I finally made it to this point and I can actually use it. But sad to say you can't. Mainly the reason why this happened is because the Bee Swarm Discord actually decided to, you know, boost this baby up as high as it can go. And they keep doing it because these guys are crazy with their, with their honey collection. I'm honest with you guys. But honestly, what Honest should be doing, he should reset it like every couple months. When it gets to this level, when no one, like my level even, can use this on a daily basis, it's useless to everyone except for super high tier people. And I don't think he's meant for that to happen. And I'm going to show you why this is very beneficial for us. So first of all, I'm going to be getting myself this boost right here, Okay. Okay, guys, I'm going to be getting this right now. We got Sun, Sunflower Field got the boost. So we know this now. So I just want to make it clear to you guys that this is the field I kind of plan on using. So I just want to also show you guys why. I'm going to be spending all of my honey in this episode just to prove a point. I don't know why I'm going to do it, but I'm going to do it. But basically, we're using the last of all the boosts that we can use. And here we go, going up here like this. There we go. And grabbing this one. There we go. We got the this right now. And then finally, we're going to go get the other one. And I know a lot of you guys are getting angry at me whenever I use this. And I don't actually use the gumdrops. The reason why I'm not using them, by the way, is because I'm getting it for the bees. So I'm getting myself three gummy bees out of that. So it's super beneficial to me. And now we're going to go to the wind shrine for the last part of the boost. So like I said, you can get a super boost in the game with all of them put together. Believe me, it's worth your time. But when you can't use market boost, it's not worth your time anymore. Like, I can't even use it, and I can only use the, like, the basics of the basics. So what we're going to be donating right now, we need something that's going to be probably really, really, really good. So I'm feeling like maybe we should donate. No, I'm going to need that. So we're going to pass that by, and we're going to donate one of these guys right here. And hopefully we get ourselves something we want. And we got nothing of benefit. So we're just going to take it all either way. I don't care. And now we're going to go and spend it on the only market boost we have. Actually, I'm actually having second guesses about this right now. Because we don't even have the mono chick boost. So no, we're not going to do it. But what I was going to show you guys is that for the value you're putting into this. The value you're putting into this, you need to have like top tier Bs. And yet you see it's one point, it's, it's a 1.5 boost for the mountaintop. 1.25 top field tools and conversion and such etc different ones give different boosts by the way so that's very useful if you have the money for it i am literally on the the bare minimum of getting what i need so we got actually this is actually kind of beneficial we got sunflower field and the other boost but think about this guys if we got all oh, we even got lucky yo no way Okay, so this is a white field. So we have to go to the tippity top, get a boost, and see if we actually get the boost in this field. Probably not going to get it. But as I'm continuing on, the reason why the, they should be reset, again, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to keep resetting this, is because if we don't reset it, no one can use it. You only need 30 bees to get in that area. And once you have 30 bees, you can't even touch the marketplace. Originally, it was very low amount. Like anyone in there in, that was able to do it could do it. 
And that's what made it so awesome. Oh, my last marshmallow be. Oh, my gosh. Yo, that is crazy. So what we're going to do now is use one of these. And then we're going to do this. And then we got mountaintop. And we got mountaintop. Really? Really? So I'm just going to show you guys right now what this boost can do. So I have, like, no honey whatsoever. And if I was to get the market boost, I'll have 1.5 more of everything in this field. And if I had the modern chick boost, it would also be the same exact thing, along with the wind boost, which I have right now. So, the thing about this one, for the lower tier players trying to make it to the higher tier, they won't be able to do much because that market base is literally designed for the richy rich. And I know Ana doesn't want it to work that way. And honestly, this is like a shout out to him for a great system he created. But also, it's a very broken system that he should definitely find a way to reset. Like, maybe it auto-resets every couple months. And basically, that means it goes back down to its basis. It goes back down to the normal things. And obviously, it'll get better stats once it's actually used a lot. But when it's overused like this, it doesn't get better stats. It actually stays at the minimum. Like, literally, guys, you saw that. I'm going to go back up there one more time. I know I'm wasting some of my boost, but this is... I feel like this is worth explaining one more time to you guys. You probably saw it already, but I just want to go back up here again. Oh, oh I got, I'm stuck. Why am I not moving? <laughs> what the? Oh, I got stuck in the wall. That was weird. But anyhow, we're going to go back over here for a second. So I just want to show you guys. So you see how this position right here, the chart position hasn't moved, but this one has. Because Butterfield actually was very low, but now it's going up there. So it, it changed position. It gets a plus two. So all the stats actually do increase by a little bit. So, so basically, recent sold. See how many were is being sold? Negative because it's less sold. Uh, this is sold more. And these right here, I can actually use these now, but I can't use this one because it's two trillion. So as you see, when it's not sold or touched, it doesn't do much. And so wait, wait, wait. Did I did it? Was it actually sold? Yeah. See, this one has zero sold. This had ninety eight sold, and this is within a day or so. So as you see, not many people can get it. So it's not very beneficial to everyone around right now, if you get what I mean. So I honestly feel, and a lot of you probably agreeing, and I want to know if you guys are disagreeing by down below in the comments and tell me why. It's like, I get it, it's supposed to be for like showing that, yeah, like it's supposed to be for the top tier players and it's supposed to be super awesome. But even for top tier players, you're not getting a crazy awesome boost out of it. You're only getting bare minimum. I've done videos before when I use the boost with basically so many other boosts mixed with it. And you get nothing out of it, like, literally. I remember back in the day, I could spend, like, a couple billion, I think that, or even a couple million, to get myself a Rose Boost so I can have more attack power, so I can be able to fight more things, which was super duper helpful. But now you can't really do much. So it's kind of upsetting to those that are wondering, like, what you can do, and um, we're going to keep trying to do this boost. We're going to see how far we can make it. But... As you know, like, I currently can now get another one, but I can't get the one I need for this. And this is by, again, by, by, you guys know, this is a lower tier field. So having that little boost for a lot less price would be super beneficial. And I'm going to go through this whole grind session with you right now to prove my stats. And say, like, show you guys what you can get. So right now, this is what I have. So remember, we just started in this field. Like, straight out started. So see this? We know that's the wrong one. We see this. I don't know why I went over there. We got eight billion already. And we just started. So just think about this one. If we had the boost also for the marketplace in this one, that would probably be like sixteen billion right now. So you can see like how beneficial it is for a person of my stature. And for the people that have like max LPs, it's probably gonna be even higher. So it's only beneficial that it resets. Like when it gets to this amount, it should be like a set of a flux. It should actually like start dropping in value because like I think that's how the stocks work. Like when they go super high, not many people can buy, and eventually it starts dropping down. And he should actually make it a little bit more aggressive. So that that basically it can't go after a certain point. Like, say for example, if it hits like 20, 30 billion, it should stop. Because I feel like when it goes too high, no one can get it. Or if it can go to as high as he wants, and every month it resets back down to what it was. And by resetting it, it allows for everyone else to have another chance at it. And it also makes people want to come on more often. I feel like if we had the market boost lower, more people would want to play. But that's me. Like, honestly, if I had the market boost, a lot of the quests that we're doing right now would probably have been completed. Oh, actually, I can probably grab this right now. Yeah, did I? Did I? Did I grab it? 
No, I didn't. Okay, never mind. But you see, guys, what I'm saying? Like, it makes sense. Like, the, the, the resetting of it doesn't seem like a bad idea. Or maybe you can even add something into it that for the server you're playing on, you can click a button, spending some um, honey on it probably, or even some treats or something of the sort, and you can reset it for that server for whatever amount of time that server is live. And by resetting it, you put the stats back down. Obviously, it gets rid of all the 2 plus and whatnot. But it'll make it server-based. So basically, if a server's brand new, it'll be low. Uh, or it'll be high, unless until you reset it. And then it gets lower and lower and gets higher and higher as you play more on that server. Or maybe it just goes by character base. I don't know. But the character base one doesn't really seem like a market at that point. It just seems like, hey, here's a boost. And I get what he was trying to do with it. He was, he was like basically saying, hey, I want like a cool market thing going on here. And it works. It really does. But when the market value goes too high, he either has to make it so the honey you earn in-game just alone will qualify for it. So like right now, a lot of those are in the trillions. So I feel like the boost you get for those should also equal what they're paying. So, for the really rich people, yeah, they're going to make way more out of it. Like, 100%. But for the poorer people that actually get the amount to make for it, they're not going to make back what they put in. You should always be able to make back what you put in, or at least get close to it. Because if you can't, then it's basically not beneficial to anyone. And basically, there's people just trolling us right now. It just became a troll fest. Like, 100%. And honestly, I would love to see a reset. I, I honestly would. And I feel like a lot of the people will agree with this. Remember, guys, leave a like if you agree. If you disagree, tell me why down below in the comments. And also, feel free to share this around because the more people that see this, the more chances that everyone will find out and start agreeing with it. Oh, my gosh. I am actually making way more stuff in this than I expected. This is pretty awesome, actually, right now. But this is, again, a lower tier field. If I had a market boost in this field, I feel like I would do a lot more better. Like, 100% honest with you guys, I feel like this would be a lot more beneficial to all of us if this market was lowered. If it was lowered in some form, or if he wanted to. I don't think he can do this because of legal reasons, because of how stuff works with gambling and whatnot in games. But maybe he can add a stock option to it, like boost stocks. You can put you can put some honey into the stocks, and you can actually earn honey. Like the more something's used, like say for example, somebody wants to put honey into coconut field, they can put some money into it, or honey into it, and actually earn like more honey back as it's being used. So you earn a per per portion portion of the profits on that. So it makes it so that you have a better chance of actually getting that boost by just affording the profits. So you get what I mean, right? So basically, like a dividend, you can get money, or you just leave it in there and just use it, whatever it's earning, to pay for that. So you can actually eventually earn enough to actually buy your own. And as the stock's not used, it should be lowered, like, somewhat. So they basically, you're earning money, and if the stock lowers, you still have that money there, and you just buy it and bring it back up. You get what I mean? But that's just a small idea, and honestly, it probably won't be done because of, again... Reasons with gambling and stuff like that. I don't know if stocks fall under that category or what. I am not 100% sure. But I feel like that would work out a lot. Okay, do we still have the boost in this field? We still got it. I, I actually don't know. Do we lose it? Is it gone? I'm looking around. I'm not seeing any stars anymore. Was that really the whole boost? Yo, really? No way. Wait, 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 wait. Hold on. I'm not seeing the star up here anymore. Yeah, it's done. Okay, guys, that, that is all we're doing for this one. And that was us showing to prove a point. 30 billion in this field. So just think about that one. If I was to get more than 30 billion right now, like if I had that market boost, it doesn't give a large amount, but it gives enough to help out. So if I had Mondo Chick with the market boost, with, uh, oh, we got wind boost. So if we had every boost, including like this maxed out, I feel like we would probably get some crazy things in this. But guys, that is the end of the episode. I want to know your guys' opinion again down below in the comments. But thank you guys for watching. Thank you all for being here. Remember to comment, like, and share this video around and show it to all your friends. Until we meet again, until the next episode, thank you all for watching and bye.